Okay, this setting up filming equipment shit every day is ghetto. I'm trying to set up this camera, keep having to move it and everything. Look what happened. Whole nail come off. So now I got to film looking like a damn fool. It's ghetto. What's up, y'all? It's Amanda, okay? Y'all already know what it is. Boom. So, I'm in this trying to film and everything. So, uh, what I know I'm in a different area right now. I actually came in the bathroom, so, you know, the lights and all that stuff is set up. But, I told you guys I would come in from uh, with the Beauty Creations foundation swatches and stuff since I ordered samples from them. These are the samples. These are the champions. But anyway, and then they also gave me um they also gave me a primer. And I don't know if this stuff is going to if I'm in focus or what. So sorry, y'all. I don't know. So let me see. I think I might be in focus if I sit up. But anyway, so they gave me a little uh hydrating primer. Now, um, what was I gonna say? I forgot. Y'all have been trying to set this camera up right for a minute and I'm aggravated so anyway but I'm not gonna let that reflect on these foundations okay because I really want to be able to purchase one but so it looks like the primer is a green from what I can see it came out on the towel so let's just get in this thing okay so this is the primer so it is green it doesn't have a smell at all and I think I put it on my damn nose so I already moisturized my face y'all so Let's just get into it. So I'm going to put this primer on because I'm pretty sure they gave it to me for a reason. And so I got to use it. But yeah, so. And I hope the lighting is good in here. I tried to get it as close as I could. And the bathroom lights seem to be hitting on something. So um, oh, now I can smell something. It, it just smells like a general lotion, like a regular lotion that is not scented or whatever. So it's not a bad scent or a heavy scent. All right, so um, let me wipe my lips. Cause I got some on my lips. But anyway, so it doesn't feel any type of way on the skin. So seems pretty good. And I've already moisturized my face with my little concoction, y'all. I showed y'all that previously, what I use. Okay, so I went ahead and put that on. Now, I told you guys that I received, I ordered four of the samples. So I ordered 8.0, and this is what it looks like. And I ordered nine, that's what nine looks like. And then I ordered seven and a half, and then I ordered eight and a half. Now, just looking at them, it looks like seven and a half is definitely out of the question. Okay, maybe for like under my eyes, something to highlight. Um, eight looks decent. Eight and a half looks a bit more decent. And nine, it looks a little bit on the gray side. So I don't know. Y'all tell me what y'all think. But these are what they look like. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to swatch all of them on my face and then we'll go from there. So I'm going to go ahead and open them up because no, I'm not prepared because I'm pissed off about my nail. <laughs> so no, I'm not prepared. But what I'm going to do is just open them up and put them in order. Eight and a half. If I can open them because now my hand has that. What you call them there? But yeah. All right. And see, that's about how much you get in there. Just, you know, just enough to try it so you can figure out your color. All right. So, let me get my brush, and this is what I hold my brushes in. I bought this from Target around Easter, and um, I bought it specifically to hold my brushes in. I like, like, if I'm sitting on the counter, I don't like them uh, getting dusty, and that keeps that from happening. So, I have my brushes in here. And it's good for traveling, because that's what I needed it for as well. What is this? How did this get in here? See, see that what happened when you got kids? Why is this in my brush container? Like... They just throw, like they throw stuff in your purse. They throw stuff in anything that belongs to you. They just gonna throw it in them. <laughs> anyway, all right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this um, flat foundation brush so I can spread it on. I don't know why I'm wasting my time with seven and a half. Cause listen, y'all know damn well 
Y'all know this ain't fitting nobody, okay? Look, not up in here. Okay. All right. But I'm still going to try it. I'm still going to swatch it. Okay, so... <coughs> Seven and a half. Listen, I'm glad I ordered this, the samples, because the website... I mean, not the website. Instagram be making it look so different. Like, I should have got a paper towel or something so I can um, get these colors off of here. Anyway... This is eight. I'm gonna turn the brush over. Okay. This is eight. Listen, when I say this stuff got some coverage, honey, I'm barely touching it. Like, what in the hell? I actually think eight is gonna work because I gotta get my nails done. This don't make no sense. Um, eight and a half is on the red side, like for real, for real. If I'm looking kind of crazy, it's because I have this chair in here and, um, in the bathroom and this chair is loud as freak. So now I'm going to go in, where was I with, um, I'm going to go in with eight and a half. And why now does it look like my damn head cut off? Like <sighs> YouTube life. Okay. This is eight and a half. I don't know y'all okay and I'm not gonna go any further back than that because y'all know my face is like two-tone like a mug so all right so I'm gonna turn it over and this is gonna be nine holy shoot nine might be it y'all Can y'all see that? I can't really tell. Let me see. Put some more of that on there. Shoot. Nine might actually be it. Listen, it, hold on. Oh, I'm knocking shit over. Let me see. Y'all, nine might be that ish. Hold on. Oh, shit. Listen, y'all, if I didn't found a perfect match and a foundation, Beauty Creation's about to get this work, okay? Holy listen, I think I y'all I swear for God. And it's the one that I didn't think would match, but it's the perfect like it has the perfect neutral tones in there for me. If it don't oxidize, this about to listen, they about to get that work. Yeah, I think 9.0 is is for me, okay? I think I can't even tell it's on my face, y'all. Yeah, okay. So we finna go with 9.0, baby. <laughs> we finna go 9.0, baby. Like, I don't know. Hopefully I'm not seeing this wrong, but it look like 9.0 is about to be my bae. So, yeah. Let me see. So, I'm gonna go in with these Marcello wipes. So y'all tell me what y'all think, but dead ass, I think 9.0 is spot on. And I've never, let me tell you something. I haven't had a direct spot on um, color match since the first, my first favorite foundation, which was my first high-end foundation, which was Makeup Forever when they had the HD foundation, the first batch of it before they changed it over. Listen, the I think it was Y75 or something like that. When I say that was my perfect match, I haven't had a perfect match since. But this... This might be your girl. And I like it. I can't feel it on my face. So let's see. Let me turn the big mirror around there. Oh, hell no, I ain't doing that. <laughs> anyway, so these definitely are not gonna work with this. With this one right here, you can't even tell it's on my face. And I hope I'm looking at this right, y'all, because let's see, eight and, what is this? This one is eight and a half. 
I don't know. What I'm going to do is put eight and a half on one side and nine on the other. And y'all tell me what y'all think. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. But y'all know I don't like looking like a um, Oompa Loompa soon. Okay, let me put this mirror closer because it ain't like I got no glasses on. Hold on. Y'all, I don't know. Both of these match so well. Okay, I see. And I didn't do any color correcting because I don't want anything to compromise the color. Okay. So, this one... Oh, it's like a, it has a floral smell. So if you don't like that, it's not overpowering, but like when you go to put foundation on your nose, you obviously can smell it. And you know how our nose run when we do, um, you know, makeup. Okay, so I will say, I definitely, with this brush, like I don't know if it's the brush or what, but I can feel it. And I hope you guys can see that, but it's um it's it's a thicker consistency. It's not bad though. Um, I don't feel like I'm painting my face, but you can definitely feel the foundation on your face. So y'all know how I am about that. I don't really like feeling foundation on my face, but you know that's just my preference because I'm not a full coverage type of girl. I do feel like this has a good amount of coverage to it. Um, let's see. the the primer didn't do anything for pores so i definitely um don't see it doing anything for pores um it has a pretty good coverage i would definitely put it on the fuller coverage side because you can feel it on your face now listen eight and a half would be good if I was one of those people that liked the redder side of foundations like eight and a half would be a good color match for me but I'm not I'm one of those people I like more of the the neutral undertone version so yeah okay so this is eight and I went a little bit over half y'all but don't 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 judge me and uh, I'm gonna use the top because it's more of it in nine so this is the clean brush I'm going to use for nine and let's see it's definitely like a mousse it's thick so I got to take some of that off of there because I don't I don't like pulling a lot on at one time okay and then here's the side for nine I do think nine plays better with my neck color which is what I like to go with I like to go with the color of my neck y'all tell me what y'all think And nine, for some reason, nine doesn't feel as heavy as eight. Or maybe I'm just tripping. But. Okay, so this is nine. I think nine looks better, y'all. Even just based off the fact that they have a good match for me. So. Yeah, this one matches my neck better. Me like it. All right, so y'all tell me what y'all think. And this one is eight and a half and this one is nine I'm telling y'all I am so ecstatic y'all don't even understand how I'm feeling right now about the fact that this foundation is even remotely close to my skin tone it is a bit darker I won't lie it's definitely it's darker than my neck but I like the fact that it's more of a neutral undertone 
than red. I hate when I look like an Oompa Loompa. So, I'm going to show you guys again. I'm going to show you eight and a half on this side and nine on this side. So, you guys tell me which side you think is better, eight and a half or nine. Okay? So, I am thinking nine looks better. But y'all tell me. Seven and eight are definitely not going to work. So eight and a half or nine are around my color. I do like the foundation. Um, it's not a foundation that is great for. I definitely like the coverage on it. I do like that. And it's a beautiful finish. It is like, it's not matte. It's more like a satin matte. You know what I'm saying? So it's more like that type of finish. So you can definitely go in with some powders and stuff like that, but I like it. I really do like the finish of the foundation. It looks good, has a good coverage to it. So yeah, I, I, think, I think it will work out, but I do think nine to me looks a bit better than eight and a half because of the red undertone of the eight and a half. But y'all let me know, okay? So, all right y'all, so I'm back kind of close up to y'all so y'all can see what I'm talking about. And as I'm looking in the mirror after I kind of, you know, did a little song song to it, you know, a quick face, both of them look similar. However, this one is still more on the red side and this one was still closer to my normal, you know, skin tone and everything. So, yeah, so I ain't do a whole lot like y'all look at y'all got a lip. Okay? <laughs> no, I'm just playing, but I wasn't going to do lashes and all that. And I'm just, you know, sampling the makeup. But y'all, y'all know. So anyway, I did mess on my half of y'all though, you know, but you know, whatever. So we got a name. Y'all see? And over here we have nine. Can y'all see? So eight and a half and nine. So tell me what y'all think. All right, so yeah, hopefully y'all can help me choose because listen, look, uh, foundation everywhere. Uh, I'm not sure how long it lasts and all that, but as far as the foundation, first impressions, I like it. I really, really do like it, but I think nine is going to be the color, y'all, but y'all let me know, you know, whatever. So I think that's it, y'all. I won't bother y'all no longer. Um, as y'all can see, I'm already in my night shirt, but I ain't gonna lie, I've been in this damn thing all day. <laughs> It's Saturday. So anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think as far as which one I'm actually going to go online. I forgot. I think this foundation may be like $12.99, $14.99, something like that. But anyway, and um, I think it was on Amazon. So, but I might just go to their website and get it depending on shipping. But y'all know I'm an Amazon freak. Oh, yeah. Anyway, so that's pretty much it, y'all. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Leave it in the comments below. Which color do you think I should go with? Should I go with eight and a half on the red side or nine on the neutral side? You guys let me know. So I will see y'all later. Bye.